Hey guys, I'm Cody, your Mind Fast Life Pro, and for today, I'd like to show you how to implement God Rays into the SUS V10.2 Preview 1 Ultra. But before we start, all credit goes to my good friend, Virtua Conquer 85 one of the developers of the Continuum Shader. Without his own version of this tutorial, I doubt I'd have ever made this video, so big shout out to him. Anyways, without further ado, let's get started. Two things. First, have the C shader unzipped and ready to work with on the desktop. Second, have Virtual Conquer's Seuss God Rays code ready to go as well. To download this, click on the link I've listed in the description, should be pretty obvious, and you will be taken to his version of this tutorial. In his description, you will be able to download the Seuss God Rays code file. Alright, first off, access the folder and access the shaders folder. Leave it there for now. Second, using Notepad. Open up the code file. As a tip on my part, do be sure to keep this text file close because we're going to be using it quite a bit throughout this tutorial. Back to the shaders folder. Locate composite1.fsh. Using Notepad as well. Open it up. I'm going to keep this tutorial as quick and precise as I can make it, so do pay attention. Set your cursor down on line 28. Alright, now. Simply copy lines 6 to 15 in the Seuss God Rays code and paste it in. Next, scroll down to lines 58 to 65 and highlight all the code within. In the Seuss code file, copy lines 21 to 47 and replace it with the existing code. Scroll down to line 2282. Copy the God Rays code from lines 53 to 56 and paste it in. Line 2571. Copy the code from line 62 to 121 and paste it in. Line 2661. Copy the code from lines 128 to 134 and replace it with the existing code. Save and exit. Let's continue with composite2.fsh. Open it up. Now, find line 19. Copy the code from lines 143 to 154 and paste it in. Line 52. Copy the code from lines 161 and paste it in. Line 59. Copy the code from line 168 and paste it in. A little further down, find line 525. Copy the code from lines 177 to 183 and replace it with the current code. Line 1282. Copy the code from lines 191 to 290 and paste it in. Save, and let's check this out in Minecraft. If this how to implement God Rays into the Seuss tutorial, was of any use to you, then do hit that like button. And before you go, don't forget to check out my channel for some more Minecraft tutorials, some pro quality cinematics, and a bunch of other videos that you shouldn't miss. Anyways, I'm Cody, and this is Past Life Pro, where creativity is always a part of my life, as it will be for yours. Alright, see you guys.